Hi everybody, so I cleared out all the pumpkin plants and I am putting in, I put in the cover crop and I just wanted to show you that. I have the cover crop sitting here and so you can see I have a lot of winter rye, rye grass, and then I have the daikon radishes, the big brown seeds or daikon radishes and then the mustard is the yellow there and then I have rape seed right there and then the gray ones are clover crimson clover so you can see it's coming up quite nicely out there all over let's give you a quick you can see this is the the uh, winter rye and then these larger plants here are gonna be the daikon radishes. And then this will be a mustard and rape right here. So the daikon radishes will go down and, br and bring up nutrition from um, farther below and break up hard pan. So they're a good choice. Um, the winter rye I mainly plant just to keep during the winter months, it doesn't die back as much and it will keep the soil in place and keep your nitrogen from leaching out of the soil and so I really and, and keep microbial growth growing on the roots so I really like the winter rye um, the mustard will clean up any bad pathogens in the soil so I really like the mustard as well because it will you're always dealing with diseases and stuff and it will help clean it out and then the rape and the the clover will nitrogen fix um, to the soil to bring up nitrogen from the air into the soil so that's another good choice and this is for the fall this is fall planting of, of a cover crop so it can it will survive a lot of the cold uh, unless we get really cold and it will die off and then hopefully the winter rye will stay there you can hear the guineas in the background They're, they decided to come and check out what was going on anyways uh, thanks for watching uh, appreciate it. Uh, drop down in the comments. Let me know what you think.